Uh, this is a cumifrons. So it's a rangimorph fossil. Uh, so that's a group so of organisms. Yes, yeah, so they're oh, standing upright. Okay. Yeah. Next thing I want to ask is about uh, astrobiology and yes. how can we transfer uh, all these things we've learned about uh, the Akara biota biology into this new emerging field of astrobiology. If we find life in the form of biosignatures, for example, on lots of different planets, how would that compare to what we see on Earth? If we have, as some people feel, we might end up in you know, 10, 20 years' time with thousands of biosignatures, we can start to then compare that to what we would expect if life progressed as it did on Earth. So to me, it's really, really strange that we have over three billion years of life before we get animals. And to me, that raises a question is like, did we get very unlucky here on Earth? Was it hard here on Earth for us to evolve animals? Or the alternative is, did we get really lucky? And actually, it's near impossible to get this sort of level of, of biological complexity we see. And as a result, you know, we're not going to find them any, any, anywhere else.